Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to fix the Apex Legends crash without any error. So if your game is crashing without show any error showing up, then this is a fix for you. And before we start, I just want to say subscribe to my channel and now we can start. So basically what you want to do is just go to this PC, so open it. Now go to the drive where you have Apex Legends installed, so for me that is, it's local disk C. Now go to program files x86, open the origin games folder, double click on apex and now what you want to do is just right click on easy anti cheat launcher.exe, so right click on it and click on properties. Okay, now what you want to do is open the compatibility tab. And once you do that, you want to click on run this program in compatibility mode 4. So you want to check that. And you want to have Windows 8 selected. Once you do that, just select the disable full screen optimizations. So check that. And check the run this program as an administrator. Once you do that, you can now just click on apply and OK. What you want to do now is the same thing for r5apex.exe So click on it, uh, right click on it, open the properties Go to the compatibility tab Select run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8 And have the disable full screen optimizations And run this program as an administrator boot checked Click on apply Click on ok and close the window okay now what you want to do is open this PC again so open it and now go to the local drive the local disk C click on users open the user that you have uh, that you are currently logged on so for me it's PC now go to saved games Open the respawn folder, double click on Apex, now go to local and open the video config. If you can't open it, then just right click it, uh, right click on it and click on open with and select notepad, notepad and open it with notepad. Once you do that, you want to scroll down and find the frame time max and frame time minimum. So there they are, setting.dvs, GPU, frame time, min and max. And now what you want to do is set the frame time max to 60. And set the frame time minimum to 31. Once you do that, you want to scroll a little bit down. And, and now you want to change the setting.mat uh, vsync mode and set it to 3. OK, and now just click on file and save the document. You can now close the notepad file. And now what you want to do is right click on video config.txt again. So right click on it, go to properties and select read only attributes. So check the box and click on apply. Now click on OK. And basically this will uh, disable Apex Legends from making any changes to this file. Now you can just close this window and restart the game. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, like and comment.